You right, guys? So a lot of people have been asking me where I find vocals for my tracks. There's a few websites and apps that I use to source my vocals. I do spend a lot of time looking through different libraries to find the right vocals, but everyone knows that a great vocal is essentially the cornerstone of every great track. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so first we've got Splice. Everyone knows Splice. If you don't, you've been living under a rock. Um, Splice is the biggest library of vocal samples, but as anyone can really upload to it, there's a lot of crap on there. Amongst the crap though, there are some gems and even some of the biggest producers use samples from Splice. Uh, for example, John Summers track Deep End, that's actually a Splice vocal. There's also a few other tracks in his library that feature Splice vocals. Okay, so there's a few ways to find vocals using Splice. So if you go to Sounds, go to Instruments, Vocals, then it comes to this. You're then gonna to wanna to go to Samples. At this point, there's a couple of things you can do. If you've already got a track laid out, okay, so you know it's in like, say, A minor, then all you gotta do, and the quickest way to find a vocal for that track is go to Key, A minor, and then this lists all of the samples on the website in A minor. Once you've done this, you can then search by most relevant. So this will bring up the most popular, the most sort of relevant. But then it, what I do, as I've heard most of the old samples, I go to most recent, and this basically shows all the ones that are listed most recently. I then obviously then scroll through. There's a lot of deep diving. You're gonna be going through pages and pages and pages but eventually you are gonna find that one that matches your track. So yeah, once you've found a sound that you like, all you've got to do is download it, click in that, then you can go to the Splice app. This will basically be a, a library of all your downloaded vocal samples, and you can also search them by key and by tag, so female, spoken word, genres. So yeah, that's Splice. Okay, so the next one is Loop Cloud. This works in the exact same way as Splice. It's essentially subscription based. Um, the thing with Loop Cloud is that it's not as high quality as Splice. When I say this, I mean some of the vocal samples on there just seem to be recorded with quite poor microphones. Um, and this does reflect in your tracks. I would recommend this website for things like drums, and house packs, but less so for vocals. Although, just like Splice, if you keep digging, you will find something usable and find something that fits your track. So the next one is Vampa. A lot of people haven't heard of this. Um, it's an app that connects musicians in a similar way to Tinder. So you download it on your phone, and just like Tinder, you see people's profiles, you can either swipe right or swipe left. So there is quite a large user base on this app, although it's definitely still growing. So on the app, there are a lot of singers. A lot of them are quite amateur though. Some of them don't even have microphones, so make sure you ask them first. Like Tinder though, if you swipe enough, you're gonna get some good matches. I did actually work with a singer on a track I matched with on Vampa. I met up at a studio because she didn't have a mic. Um, but yeah, I was really happy with the way it turned out. The track's not quite out yet though, because I'm a lazy cunt and I can't be asked to mix the vocal. I would definitely recommend this app to anyone trying to connect with vocalists and for artists who want original vocals for their tracks. The next website is Soundbetter. I might be wrong, but they have a link with Spotify, so I think they're a Spotify partner. Soundbetter is great if you have a lot of money. Um, vocalists charge from anywhere to 40 quid to 10 grand. Um, the services include writing, top lining, and singing vocals for your track. Um, although I've not used this website, I know quite a few producers who have and it turns out great. The good thing about this website is that it's people who are serious about their craft, unlike Vampa, where a lot of them are just messing around. Another reason this website is great is that the people on there show their previous work. So all the vocalists show work that they've done on previous tracks. Um, so you can really get a feel for the musicians' vocal styles. So yeah, the great thing about this website is that all of the vocalists show previous works that they've done on other tracks. So yeah, this really helps you see that artist's vocal styles and the way they write tracks. So yeah, as you can see here as well, 
it shows the reviews for people who have bought um, the service from the singer and so you can really see if people think they're professional um, if they've say killed it she slayed it he's saying so yeah you get a really good feel if they're worth investing your money into or not okay guys so lastly we have Fiverr most people know what Fiverr is it works in the same way as sound better but has less strict rules and pretty much anyone can sell their product or service um, so although the vocalists are going to be cheaper they might not be as high quality so you really have to dig deep and find vocalists that have high reviews and are using expensive microphones because there's no point buying one that's quite cheap if it's not going to be usable because I've done that on this website before. Okay guys, so that wraps it up for the five websites and apps that you can use to find vocals for your track. Again, Splice, Loop Cloud, these are royalty free however they're not going to be original so any other producer could use that same vocal sample this isn't necessarily an issue as some tracks don't get signed to labels so the vocal doesn't end up being used anyway but yeah with vampa and sound better and fiverr vampa is the cheapest option because you're not really got to pay anything to the vocalists it's more of a collaboration system whereas sound better and fiverr you have got to shout out a bit of money um to also get the vocal right guys well i thank you for watching Please comment below any videos that you want to see next, um, any tutorials or videos like this. Thank you very much. Take care.